Loading trick. Funky chicken. Since this is one of your first scuffing tricks, you're going to have to figure out which foot to scuff with. Once you feel more natural, it's either going to be your right foot or it's going to be your left foot. Now just like with uh, handwriting, one of your hands writes better than the other one. It's the same way with scuffing. One of your feet is going to be better at scuffing than the other one. If you're scuffing it righty, here's how you get into the trick. Grab the seat with your right hand and swing the frame around in front of you. Make sure that you're grabbing the back of the seat with your hand. Now take your right foot and put it over the handlebar. You can just set it on the ground for right now. Alright, now it's go time. Take your right foot and put it on top of the tire. You're going to put all your weight on that foot as your left foot pushes off the ground and goes on the peg. The scuff is the hard part, but the more you practice, the better you're going to get. Here's how it looks in real time. Scuffing is a pretty hard technique to learn, so you're probably going to repeat this step over and over, but it's well worth it. Here's a closer look at the scuff. Just like all scuffing tricks, dragging your foot back in the tire is just as, if not more important than kicking the tire forward. It's kind of weird at first, but before you know it, your foot's going to be doing it and you won't even have to think about it. Here's how it should look at normal speed. When you're locked in on a scuffing trick, you should never use the brake. Standing on your heel is a bad habit. You want to stand on the ball of your foot. When you got the scuff part dialed, you can set it down and learn how to ride in and ride out. Here's the first way how I learned how to ride into a funky chicken. It's not the best looking way, but it's definitely the easiest. Alright, let's take a slower look at these. You're going to spin around, then you're going to put your foot over the bars, onto the frame, grab the seat, and when you start scuffing, you got to pick up the back end. Now to ride out, grab the front brake and throw your leg around the handlebar, let the frame drop down, and then the rest is yours. If you're a left footed scuffer, here's how it should look. It's real important that you monkey around with both feet to see which one's your natural foot. I think you can link the funky chicken up to probably a million different tricks. Here we got a different ride in, and then we're going to finish off with the front yard. Start out holding the seat, grab the brake and spin around, and make sure your leg gets around that handlebar. For the front yard, grab the front brake and lift your right foot over the top too. You can also do a steamroller in and a steamroller out. 